Hi guys, we're back at Smash Fishing. We've got Sam with us today. Hell yeah. And we're going out on an all out lobster mission. So stay tuned. We've got a really low tide today and we're going to find a few creatures along the way. It's Smash Fishing, baby. Woo! Looking forward to this one. We've been out with the shrimp nets a lot lately, so we decided to go on just an all out lobster mission and just see, see if we can get a couple of decent keepers. Fingers crossed, we got a beauty, eh mate? Hopefully mate. Hell yeah. Some really colorful rainbow rack here. There seems to be a lot of different colors lately. We've seen a pink, green, blue, you name it. Big guns, Sam, big guns. Oh, big lady. Female. Oh, oh, it's got a softy underneath. Look at that. That's mine. That's the male there, guys. Always protecting the female. Look at it. He's trying, to, he's trying to eat Sam. <laughs> Good luck. Stick that back down there. Go on then, mate. Go. Oh, good idea. Got to take care of the sea life, guys. There we go. They're all safe. Coming out. No, this is that. Oh, there he is. Yeah, I can see his tail. Go on, Sam. <laughs> oh, well, my mate. There you go. First Larry of the day. <laughs> Look at that. Got him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll get it the camera, mate. Uh, huh? Little one. A little gimby claw in it as well. There you go, guys. Nice little Larry there. Little baby one. Little baby male. Yeah, hopefully we can get that big one. Yeah, we're putting back. Oh, fingers crossed for a monster. Do quite well out of this hole, eh? This hole's produced quite a few lobsters in the past, though. Definitely, mate. Nice old warmer, shall I? Yeah, empty. Yeah. Definitely legal. Perfect condition as well. Yeah, it's a lovely. Yeah. pearl effect. Looks wicked. <laughs> She's a big one. I can see a lobster claw, a big lobster claw. Yeah? Yeah. Where there's a conga, there's a lobster there's baby. There's a big lobster claw. Oh, oh, he's just popping back. I see. Right, you get keep the conga out. Keep doing that. Let's go. Oh, all right. This is a big conga. It's a nice conga. Yeah, really like to see its claw. It's a nice one, mate. Yes. She's a female. No eggs. Nice size that. Hopefully she's in. Woo! There's a big conger in there. Oh, well, yeah. Look at that, smack on the money that. Try the second eye. There you go guys. That lobster's in just about as well. Lovely job. One lobster down, beautiful. We're gonna try and get this conga out. Where there's a conga, there's always a big lobster. Beautiful.
Oh, so close. Almost. <laughs> He's a big boy, eh? Yeah, very nice size. Oh, he got his tail. Oh, <laughs> I took some persuading, eh, mate? That's a nice one, mate. That's a beauty. God, I was trying to hold his tail and then uh, tickle his head so he slides through my hand. He was having none of it. <laughs> what a beast. That's a lovely size eel, that one. Look at that. That's mean. Beautiful condition as well, eh? Lovely. What a lovely eel that is. And as always, where there's an eel, there's a lobster. <laughs> Oh, what a beast, a well chop of that. Look at the size of that bad boy. Catching bigger ones with your hands than we can with the rods. We're doing well foraging at the moment, <laughs> eh, mate? Yeah, we have, we've only had whips lately. That's a beauty, what would you give that? Six, seven pounds? Yeah, definitely, mate. Beauty, what a lovely fish. Hell yeah. We just double checked this lobster, guys. And as you can see, it looks about half a millimeter out. That's why it's always good just to double check. So this, this female's going back, and I put him back in there. That's a shame, eh? Oh. Still legal, but... Oh, it's, it's Guernsey legal size, but it's not, it's not smash legal size. <laughs> Our size limit is 90 mil. So, uh, that's a shame. That was a lovely hard lobster, that one. But it's a female, so that's all good. Do you want to put the conga back, mate? Yeah. I can't believe that. That's a beauty of a conga. I'm glad we managed to get it out. We were going to give up, eh? It's, it's full of life, that thing. Oh, yeah. Do you want to give the folks a little show again? Last show with a slab. What a cracking eel. That's a mouth you don't want to get bitten by, guys. <laughs> Go on then, mate. Beautiful. Sliver her back on in. There we go. Those two will live a happy little family. And hopefully we can find a keeper. Plenty of big old abalone in there. I don't know if you can see that there, guys. Lovely size abalone in there. Oh, look, there's another one down there as well. Roll on January. <laughs> Perfect little lobster hole down here. Sam's found the ultimate Orma rock by the sounds of it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, look at that, they're everywhere. Just under one rock, eight Ormas. Yeah, there's a little baby oh, one little, there. A little tiny one. <laughs> That's a whole family of Ormas right there. Haliotis tubercolata is the Latin name. The green Orma or abalone. Hey! <laughs> That's a big spiny starfish right there. Look at the size oh, no. of that. That's a nice find that, what's it eating? Those are winkles. Yeah. Nice. And a stone. <laughs> See all these little tentacles here guys? They rummage around, walking along the seabed, feeding on all the little crustaceans and stuff. You can see them moving. Looks wicked. Got another lobster here guys. Not really sure how big he is. Come on buddy. Ow, pinch me. Come here. There we go guys. Another lobster. Not big enough though. It's a shame. Nice male. Ah, it's a shame it ain't big enough. Look at that. We're finding a good stamp of lobsters though, eh mate? Yeah. What a beauty. Come on, you big lobster. Go on buddy. You wanna go back in there? That was a nice one, that. Now the lobster, guys. We're finding a few now, right in the cracks of these rocks. We're just walking along the weed edges. And boom, we're finding them. There's another big hole on the side here. 
nothing in there. Go on then, little buddy. Back home you go. Roll on, you big ones. Come on. <laughs> nothing, Sam. Not that one. Seems to be holes all over the place, eh? Big guns. There's a lobster. Come on, hold it much longer. Drop it. Too big. Uh, I couldn't see. All I seen was the whiskers. It didn't look massive. Watch your back, mate. <laughs> <laughs> you right? <laughs> Oh my god, Sam. <laughs> you got a habit of this. Yeah, I know. Do you see the dug out hole there, guys? Oh, let's go. Ah. Another little one. Another male as well. Finding a good abundance of different sorts, eh? Males, females. Yeah, it's nice to see. But we want that keeper. Check that for the smallest top knot ever. <laughs> Tiny little thing. Not doing too well on the lobster front at the moment. We ain't had no keepers yet. But a few lobsters nonetheless and that nice conga. Really chop of that. It's always nice when you get to wrestle a conga out of a, out of a big hole. <laughs> so we're going to work our way around some more rocks. Fingers crossed we can find something decent. Sam's got a lobster. It's a tiny one. Look at that, that's massive. Look at his little claw growing back. Oh yeah. Soft as anything. See that guys, that's what all, all crabs and all lobsters do the same. As they shed their shell, it gets bigger and bigger. Take my strong hand. <laughs> <laughs> back he goes. Little Larry. Look at that guys. We're heading through a dark, dark place in a dark, dark cave with a big, big boulder. <laughs> That's wicked. Any congas sticking their head out? Sort of place we're going to find a crayfish, eh? Yeah, I know. Look at that, guys. It's that boulder behind you, look. <laughs> it's a beast, eh? Yeah. There you go, guys. Sam pulls out his conga. <laughs> oh, I wonder if there's a lobster behind it. That's why I tried to get it out. Yeah. Conga's in the stream. Oh, we found a nice little spot here, guys. Just gonna push it into the water. That tide's gonna be coming up in the next 20 minutes or so. So here be all good. Check that for a rock, guys. That's what you call a family of abalone right there. You got big ones. Probably two or three keepers on there and a few smaller ones. That's wicked. Big lady crab as well. Awesome to see that. Small broadclaw porcelain crab and sea squirts. Sam's found a lobster, guys. He spotted this one like a hawk. Nah, nah, it's not a keeper. <laughs> oh. Nice to see nonetheless, though, eh? Shame it's not a keeper, though. <laughs> We've been hunting everywhere for the last god knows how long now. A couple of hours at least, eh, mate? Oh, yeah. What's he gone back down? Yeah, he's gone back down. I don't want to hurt him. Nah, that's it. Be. That's fair play. See that tide's turned now, guys? See how fast the, the water rushes in here? Because it's a causeway, it really does whip through it. Where's he gone? A little lobster in here, guys. Gotcha! <laughs> yeah, a little diddy thing that one is. But we're just working our way up with the tide now to see if we can get lucky with a nice keeper. But we're not getting too lucky at the moment, eh? Oh, ow, he got me! Oh! <laughs> Those little ones can bend their claws so far back, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Squirmy little eel. They go absolutely ballistic when you go out the rocks, but they always seem to strand themselves. 
Come here, little buddy. There we go. Go under the rock. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> but two flappy congas. Oh, that was skill. <laughs> That's all for today's episode, guys. We didn't have a try, eh, mate? We did. Yeah, we got close to a keeper, but um, we didn't come up trumps on this one. This spot is usually really good for keeper lobsters, but hey ho. You know, you can't win them all. It's fun nonetheless with the big conger and stuff, eh? Yeah, it's good. That's it. So stay tuned for the next episode, guys. If you want to check out Sam's Instagram, the link's always in the description. If you like my channel, like and subscribe. Make sure to like the video. It's Smash Fishing. Merch is in the description too. 